Okay, we're back to the game. Last we left off, our douchebag of a principal was favoring the rich honor student over the honest word of one of his students on a scholarship. So, basically things are afoot. We can time travel. We saved a girl from getting shot. And yeah, I think we're just, I guess, trying to wrap our heads around it now? I don't think we have an objective yet. Um, okay, here's a teacher. Let's tell her. God, fucking thing. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Um, there's like a kid with a gun, but sure. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. It's probably that guy that we ran into earlier, porn stash. That's crazy. I get why schools should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms. It's a slippery Creepy. slope, and it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. I'm pretty sure that didn't end well for the Native Americans, but okay. Blackwell is that old? That's incredible. You should learn a little history about your alma mater. You'll find some fascinating facts. There's a lot of power in this region. I think it helps the creative juices flow around here. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? I mean, yeah, that makes sense. Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Hope this doesn't bite me in the ass. Hmm. Well, is Miss Moore. Is it the same girl? Probably. Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. I'm gonna go on the record right now and say she did. Who are these bitches? Oh, that was that guy she was talking about earlier who was. Not an ass. Hey, Hayden. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. Hmm. I need what to the know hell what is the Vortex, Vortex Club, Club anyway? Is... It seems so elitist. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night, then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. You mean hang with a Vortex Club? That sounds like a setup to a horrible prank. Chillax, paranoia girl. We're not that desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. Hmm. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like, you know. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? So you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked to party. <laughs> fun to be around. Oh, yeah, and she was hot. His voice does not match his face. Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. What do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace? So bad things, apparently. 
Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us. And I'll deny I ever said that. I have a feeling he's not the right person to talk to about Nathan, so... Let's talk later, Hayden. Bye, Max. No. I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. I have a feeling that's probably not gonna end up well for us, but whatever. The hell is that? Oh, a shark. Who is this? Warren. Oh, that okay, was the guy she was talking about earlier. Grab that flash drive. So, okay. <laughs> it's just a squirrel in there. Okay, so we have to go find a flash drive. Get in her backpack. Just kidding, I'm gonna go with don't. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You wanna fly my drone? Nah, bitch. Jeez. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? You, uh, your weapon, voice. Right? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Well, shit, okay. Okay, so we talked to them, talk to, what? I just wanna graduate. I bet the Black Wolf founders would shit cats if they saw today's student body walking around like zombies on their phones. Something gonna this happen by us sitting here? so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. Hmm, okay. Anyone around? What? This is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody got their wish. Hmm. Talk to them later. girl was in our class. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? I think so. I don't We're really. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. She's just studious, studiously great, ignoring I'm us. I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. I don't think that's legal. Victoria is pretty obvious. I don't think Jefferson is into her. I don't think she's closed the deal, but she's not the only player. Now, how do you know this? You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Oh. Well. I heard that from a good source. Um, interesting. See, you learn something new every day at school. Like I said, you have a lot to learn. Max, see you in class. Well, at least she was nice. Let's just go talk to these guys now. 
since apparently she liked that one guy. Still can't quite tell what's on his shirt. Yo, Justin. Check out the mat. Come to thrash? Oh yeah? Bring it. What's your first Jeez. move gonna be? Uh... Jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Yo, Justin. Check out the max. I came to nose slide, but I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah, I just can't skate worth shit. Oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Um. Go for a tree flip. Let's get Trevor all over that action. That was the guy she thought was cute earlier. <laughs> what? Oh my god, are you okay? Are you oh. Okay, take a picture of him instead, you dick. Yes, squirm. It's good for the lighting. Well, that's unfortunate. She was going to use that eventually. I wonder if he'd say anything else. Hey. I'm stoked to see those photos framed and shit. You never really escaped Betty, though. Um, not really. <laughs> not really. Too bad. It's nice to have the females on board, too. Rachel Amber and her punk friend used to love skating with us. Um... You knew Rachel? She used to chill with us sometimes. But one day she just vanished. I hope she's living the dream somewhere. If anybody hurt her will get a skate posse and take them out with our boards. Hmm. Okay. Who was Rachel's punk friend? I can't remember her name. She was hot. Tats, blue hair, hardcore. She stopped hanging out with us after Rachel disappeared. Or <laughs> ran away. That was the girl from earlier. You ever hang out with Victoria? Fuck that. <laughs> I'd rather rollerblade than hang out with snobs like her. Had a kid. Let's chill later, Justin. Anytime you want to take some action shots, we're here for you, Max. Can we, like, talk to this guy? Can I, like, steal his board? Apparently not. Hey. Oh, okay, never mind. Hmm. This guy that was getting bullied earlier. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. His voice is really wigging me out. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. Hmm. You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait. Oh, she was a natural. So what happened to her? There's gotta be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. Okay, why don't you start drawing me, even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way, you're a good substitute, Muse. Oh, that's a good posture. Good, good. I feel like he's not supposed to be creepy, but he is kind of creeping me out. And that makes me feel really bad. Best portrait ever. Okay. Alright. Um. Let's 
go talk to this guy. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. <laughs> Shit, okay. What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. You, you know him. I feel like we shouldn't be bragging about that. Not really, I've seen him around. Sounds like you know way more than that. Max, tell me. All right, fine. I busted him today with a gun. What? Seriously? I saw him wave a gun around today and I went to the principal. We'll see what happens next. You are my new hero. Finally, karma comes to Blackwell. I don't know if that was a good idea, but we did it, so. Now who's this guy? Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer Excuse a simple you. question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? I feel like I actually do know this. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. Yeah, I don't need That's no time I'm travel. Here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. Is that I'd like be honored, sir. code for something? Oh, there are pictures of Rachel in here. Of course. Hi, Evan. As you can see, Rachel Amber was my favorite model here. She knew exactly what angles worked best with my eye. You were close. Like brother and sister in arms. She understood me, never judged me. I hated her vortex club click, but she never acted like she cared. Her friends were her friends. What do you think happened to her? Nothing good, Max. Nothing good. Hmm. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Dude. Prescott's? Okay. Fantastic. Okay. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. I think you're better off reading chiclet. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> now if you'll excuse me. No. Okay then. Bitches. Oh, it's more oh, butterflies. No. Oh. Make art, not war. Nice. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. How did you like class today? I don't remember. I guess I don't care about much of anything today. Is there anything? Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Awesome. Hmm. Poor thing. Oh. 
Well, I tried. Can I talk to him? Apparently I can. Hi, Samuel. Well, hello there. What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? Well, only she would know that, right? Uh, I guess. It just makes the campus look sad. You can't color over that sunlight. Nice. What? Um... You knew Rachel? How can you know a prison? You just stare in awe. Now I have to go paint windows. No! What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward. Like a clock. What was she like? She must have been popular. Even sunlight can cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. She was like a battery. Positive and negative. Hmm. See you later, Samuel. And watch your step around here, Max. Nice, bro. After I sweep, I paint. What does that even mean? What does any of that even mean? Nice, bro. Alright. Um. Okay, or not. Oh, look. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. Oh, dude. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. I don't even understand. That wasn't even, like, a bad picture. Karen Smith. That's the third mean girl's name. <laughs> it really just occurred to me. It's been, like, 24 hours. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Well, then, make it so, Max. Make it so. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this! Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Nice, bro. Okay, now we're gonna... No Do you understand English? Get lost. I'm an English major, bitch. Did you like... Sorry, no paparazzi allowed. Bitch, you took my picture. Oh. Hmm. There's a totem pole out there. Turn the sprinklers back up. But now I feel bad because it's going to look like it's his fault. Okay. No way! No fucking you okay, way! Okay, Victoria? Oh, Samuel is sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Oh, hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. 
<laughs> oh, well. Look at this stupid flash drive. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? You know, we don't need another enemy in this game. And besides, I would feel bad. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. No. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. <laughs> you deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck yourselfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you Okay. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. Nope, you did the right thing. You never know where somebody comes from. Hurry, Courtney! Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Probably. Welcome to Black Hill. Oh, this is convenient. Okay, I don't think we've met Brooke yet. Stella, Dana. So the one... Where the hell are we? This must be the entrance. So... What does that mean? Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. But it said it was Stella's room. It's kind of a weird thing to say. That's a weird thing to say. As if. Okay. What does that one say? <laughs> okay. That looks like there could be creepy creeps in there. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. I don't think that's what a ghost looks like. No balls allowed. What? Seriously? Are they everywhere? That's a laugh, that's Victoria's room. Warren should be all over Brooke. Oh, They're perfect for each Brooke other. Brooke was the drone girl. Write something on your thingy. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. You're full of shit. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. Ultra vixens? Okay. Hmm. 
Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I saw... Yeah, I knew it. Well, text your mom back, Jesus. Hold your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER. I knew we were bonded forever. We're not gonna be that person at a party. It's hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Got some nice converse. Oops. Okay, sure, play some music. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Cuties. <laughs> More Catcher in the Rye references. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. I don't think that's how it works. What, that the plant will live? If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always looking. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Oh, she's still our flash drive. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Daniel has so much talent. I hope nobody hates on it just because it's me. <laughs> I love his profile picture. I am so addicted to this site. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already need a real friend here. Aw, oh, cute little pictures. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game, man. Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. It's not a good life choice. Just saying. Meh. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. So she took a picture from... Here. Interesting. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Answer, you wuss. <clears throat> Oop, Taylor's mad. Gonna write a song about it. Hey, Juliet, is everything you cool? Ridiculous. Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. She's your friend. Friends don't sex with their best friend's boyfriend. No, probably not. Definitely Taylor Swift. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Swift. Just kidding, but she really does resemble her, at least physically. Um. Mm -hmm. This one. Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. <laughs> I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Two for two. Of course I do. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. So how did you find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. Mm -hmm. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, Damn. I swear I didn't do anything, but I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is <sighs> I don't want to go in Victoria's room. <sighs> Damn it. All right. 
If I die, it's your fault. Um, shoes, gazette, gallery letter, camera, photos. I don't want, I'm not gonna mess up her fucking photos. Speaking of selfies. This is so uncomfortable. I hate being in other people's rooms. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Hmm. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. But really, like, can we just please get the fuck? I don't know how I thought I was going to print it from the printer. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Oh, okay, no, okay, no, get the fuck out of there. Whew, that was way too stressful. I hate going through other people's stuff. Even if it is virtual. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No. But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zack has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. I would hope so, after all that. Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Cheerleader outfits. Pringles. Yay! Okay. Flash drive. Take. Must protect my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. Oh, that was painful. Okay. Um, just last drive. I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. <laughs> Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. No one would ever know. Got some trophies, got the, the, what? What? Is that a pregnancy test? That looks like a home pregnancy test. Oh. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Fuck it, I can reverse time. I don't know why you want to touch her pee stick, though. Or why she still has it. Uh, Max? That's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. You're the one that walked into my room and stole my flash drive. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. That's what I'm doing, girl. Way ahead of you. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Poor Juliet gets her rage on. I hope she doesn't kill Victoria. Zachary should worry too. As if I'd let that ego case jockstrap touch me. But I bet Victoria would be all over that action. Or has been. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though, Warren obviously likes hanging with you. I was hoping it would let me do that in the second option. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. When you opened the flash drive, didn't you see the special folder called Max? Yeah, okay. I gotcha. So, like... Now I feel too wiped out to leave. <sighs> Hey, 
Hey, Dana. Seriously. Dana, I'm not trying to be nosy, but I heard a rumor about you. What? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. <laughs> you spilled the beans yourself. Acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? If you look at me while you're talking to me. Of course. I was pregnant. Was. Oh. What about the other? Deadbeat dad? You can catch him on the 40 yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. Hmm. Who then? And you don't have to tell me. In fact, you better not. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. Well, that's sad. Okay, well, let's get out of here. Everybody has a secret around here. Alright, it's probably a good place to end this. See you guys next time.